Hello boxing fans, Anthony with Bleacher Bums Gaming, aka Glory Days Games. And just over a week away from release of Glory Days Boxing. And as you can see, our game room has been turned into my uh, temporary post office. But uh, starting to put the games together in the left hand corner there, you can see already assembled games in the box ready to go. Uh, shipping box is ready cards sorted and game parts all assembled here or ready to assemble here so a week away getting excited uh, again this has been almost two full years in the making and actually was first announced I believe on the channel uh, just about a year ago today so Excited for that to happen and as we count down release, we are going to have a special fight tonight. We're going to introduce Teofilo Stevenson to the channel for the first time in a bout that he'll be a 10 round fight and he'll be taking on Ernie Shavers. Was very tempted to do a uh, Ollie Stevenson dream match but decided to save that and uh, introduce Teofilo with, I wouldn't say a lesser opponent, uh, Shaver certainly a dangerous foe and should be a good test for him so we will get right back to the action with that. Okay we are back at ringside and the fighters are ready first off in the red corner and again this is all amateur a record of 302, 22 and 0 with 198 knockouts absolutely phenomenal record hailing from Cuba Teofilo Stevenson and in the blue corner, a record of 74, 14, and 1 with 68 big knockouts, the hard-hitting Ernie Shavers. And traits in this one, uh, Stevenson has the headhunter trait, uh, extremely good at sniping away from the outside, and because of that, outside punches can't be blocked. And Ernie Shavers has the not-so-tough trait, so if less ring general stars an opponent, minus 1 from power. And that, the um, not so tough trait, just takes into account the fact, uh, and it's applied to fighters who were dominant against lesser opponents and not quite that way in terms of power, been able to get people out against fighters with more skill than them. And that is Shaver's trait. So his power against Stevenson, instead of a seven, will be a six. And still, six is his. Uh, the second highest rating you can have in the game, so nothing to sneeze at, but uh, it'll be just a little bit harder to get Stevenson out. Uh, we are ready to go. Stevenson does have an excellent chin, two against a knockdown and only one against a KO chance, and he is not bad himself in the power department. He hits uh, with a five. Uh, the one thing to watch for here, now stamina, Stevenson, because he never had to fight, had to fight over a 10 round or 15 round distance. Uh, stamina is average at 70. Shavers had issues with stamina. He is only a 60, so we'll see if uh, that comes into play for either boxer. But 10 rounds, we are ready to go. And fight is underway. And it's going to be a exchange toe to toe from the inside. And Stevenson in the red corner will go first in the first segment of the fight. And right away we have a potential cut. 44, rapid fire jabs connect, two punches landed, and we'll come back to check on the cut after Shavers goes. Shavers from the inside, and 85, and that is going to be a clinch, so forget the cut. Shavers negates any action, holding on before Stevenson can do damage to him. On to segment two, the very first round. And this is going to be two stars inside. Stevenson will be on the offense, and Shavers on the defense. Uh, 64 from the inside, that's going to be a miss. Shavers with a chance to counter, and 11 from the inside, not going to get it done. On to segment three, so neither fighter has landed a significant blow yet, both being a little bit cautious. It's going to be outside to inside, two stars to one. Stevenson in control. And sniping away now, Stevenson 31, that is going to be a combo behind a jab, three punches landed, and again, those punches cannot be blocked, we're still going to roll because Shaver's defense can add a punch to that, he does not, so on to segment four in the very first round, Stevenson with momentum, 
And Stevenson on the inside, Shavers on the inside. They're tied at two stars, so they're going to exchange blows again. Stevenson goes first. And 96 would have been, a uh, 99 actually would have been a potential knockdown, but we're going to the event chart. So we will uh, resolve that prior to Shavers resolving his toe-to-toe -to -toe exchange as the event chart, actually the event chart takes precedence. So here we go. Let's see what happens. Been a while since we had an event, 14. And fighter breaks hand, scores three punches, minus one from punches landed, and no knockdowns the rest of the fight. Wow, tough break for Teofilo. So he breaks his hand early, and that ends a segment. We're on to segment five. So from this point on, and we'll mark that as an injury on Stevenson, uh, his debut, a broken hand. Now, the other thing, uh, that is an asterisk uh, rare event. So if a event does come up at any time during the rest of the fight and we roll another event, doesn't have to be this one, any event that is followed by an asterisk, that will be considered a clinch and no action because you can only have one of those rare events a fight no matter what it is. So let's see how that factors in now. Stevenson at a big disadvantage and he's not going to be able to drop uh, Shavers due to his right hand been broken. Uh, it's definitely going to have an effect here. Uh, both fighters on the inside, two stars to one. Stevenson in control. And 48 would have been a potential knockdown. We're just going to ignore that. He misses. Uh, Shavers looking to counter, does not. And we are now into the second minute of the first round. So right away, that uh, event having an effect as uh, Stevenson would have missed anyway, but it could have been a potential knockdown. It's going to be two stars on the outside and two stars from the inside. They are going to exchange. Stevenson does have momentum, so that exchange will come from the outside. 67 going to be a miss for Stevenson. Shavers looking to land his first significant punches of the fight. 91, that's going to be a clinch. So on to the final minute of the round and definitely a very interesting first round. Both fighters been tentative, and when uh, Stevenson did land, he suffered an injury. Stevenson in control, two stars from the inside. Shavers will be on the defense. And again, would have been a potential knockdown, not going to happen due to the injury. A six lands heavy rights and lefts, four punches landed. That's going to be reduced to three due to the injury. And inside those can be blocked and not going to happen though 40 seconds left in the opening round shavers has yet to land a blow of significance and stevenson inside one star that takes it as uh shavers no stars from the outside so 44 and 44 rapid fire jabs connect two punches landed reduced to one uh, shavers will be able to block that a four he actually adds one to it so Stevenson now in the final 20 seconds has landed 11 blows to zero in this first round, dominating Shavers in that regard. And it's going to be inside two stars to one. Stevenson maintains control. And oops. Uh, 51 on the inside. That's going to be a miss. Shavers looking to counter. And seven does not. That is the first round. So a very... Uh, Interesting first round to say the least. 11 punches land for Teofilo Stevenson. Zero for Ernie Shaver. So Stevenson's stamina will stay at 70 heading into round two. And Shaver's is going to be reduced to 49. And I'm going to call this early. I'm thinking this fight, unless uh, Shaver's can land, catch lightning in a bottle, may end up going the distance because Stevenson can't score a knockdown due to that broken hand. Let's go to the judges scoring now, 11 point differential. This will go to Stevenson on every roll but a 20. And four, seven, and four. It's gonna be 10, nine across the board to Teofilo. As we head into round number two. And the bell rings, fighters come out. Fours on each side, and they are going to exchange from the outside. And again, Stevenson carrying over momentum from that first round will go first. Would have been a potential cut. That can still happen, but instead it's going to be a miss. Shavers looking to land his first blows of the fight. And finally, a wicked three-punch combo gets through as Ernie Shavers rocking Stevenson there onto segment number two of the second round. 
Let's see if Shavers can rally here. It's going to be five each, and again, they're going to exchange blows, this time from the inside, and this time Shavers will go first as he has momentum. Oh, potential knockdown, 52, but he misses. Just missed that. Would have needed a 50. So looking to counter is Stevenson, and he does not. So this fight, uh, all kinds of potential weird turns happening early here. Uh, five and a six is going to be outside. Stevenson takes back control. And Shavers will be on the defense. 72, that is going to be a miss. Shavers looking to counter does not. On to segment four of round number two. So not quite the slugfest I think people had envisioned, and it's going to be two stars inside for Shavers. He snatches back momentum. So Ernie, oh, double O's, and that's going to be a devastating combination. Five punches land, and Stevenson hoping to block maybe one of them. Rolls a seven, does not. So Shavers and that broken hand apparently is having quite the effect on Stevenson as Shavers feeling his oats coming on here in round two. It's going to be two stars outside to two stars inside. They are going to exchange from the inside toe to toe. And again, Shavers with momentum goes first. 61 would have been a potential knockdown, but he misses Stevenson looking to get his and 77. And that's going to be a miss as well. So on to segment six. And this is a complete opposite of the first round, and Stevenson is the one who can't land now. Uh, going to be two stars, each fighter from the inside. They're going to exchange again. Shavers going first. 25, and Shavers, wicked three-punch combo lands. Stevenson, hoping to get something going here at 23. Combo lands behind a jab. Three punches reduced to two due to the injury as we are into the final minute of the second round. Deuces for both. The outside, two stars to one. Stevenson snatches back momentum. So Stevenson looking to uh, compose himself. A blistering two-handed assault. Five punches land. Going to be reduced to four due to the injury. And again, Shavers uh, can't block, but he can add to that. Does not. 40 seconds left in the uh, second round. Stevenson coming on now. Three for both, and two stars on the inside for both. They're going to exchange. Stevenson first. Zero, three, and another blistering two-handed assault. So five punches land, and Stevenson closing the round big. Ernie Shavers, 48. A short, hard punches land, two of them. So he maintains the advantage as we head to the final 20 seconds. 13 punches to 12 in this round. Uh, outside two stars to outside one star. Stevenson in control. On the defense will be Shavers. And Stevenson 37. And combo lands behind a jab. Three punches land reduced to two. Shavers defensively does not add any. And the round is over. 13 to 13. In terms of punches landed. An exciting second round there. Uh, stamina down to 36 goes Ernie Shavers and down to 57 going into round three goes Stevenson. So dead even round. So the way it's going to work here is one to five will be Stevenson, six to 10 Shavers and 11 to 20 dead even. That's going to be even, even, and seven that is going to go to Shavers. So Ernie coming back here in the second round, and again, that injury definitely having an effect on Stevenson. Took away a couple of uh, potential knockdown chances. Round three is underway, first segment. Inside one star to inside two star Shavers. Has momentum here as we start the third round. And 44, that's gonna be a potential knockdown. And Chin check for Stevenson. 44 is going to be a short, hard punches land. Two of them. And Stevenson, he is hard to get off his feet. Going to be a two or better to get him down. And he is fine. On to segment two. Uh, five, three to five, he would be stunned. And two or one down. So segment two, outside two stars to inside two stars. They're going to exchange blows from the inside. Shavers first since he has momentum. Potential cut here, 39, and it's going to be another two-punch salvo. We will come back and check the cut on Stevenson after he goes. 
So Stevenson from the inside and 90, that is going to be a clinch. So never mind those two punches and no cut. On to segment three, and the clinch has also played a factor in this a couple of times already. Inside one start at two, Shavers maintaining control and on the defense of Stevenson. So 48 on the inside, another two punch combo lands and 17. Stevenson not able to block it onto segment four. Five and one, and it's going to be two stars again tied. They're going to exchange blows, and again, it will be from the inside since Shavers has momentum. 65, Shavers could have been another potential cut, but he's going to miss. Stevenson fires back, 93, and guess what? That is another clinch. So that would have nullified any action that did take place. On to the next segment, and no stars outside for Stevenson. One star outside for Shavers. Shavers looking to box, outbox the boxer. Uh, 13 from the outside, and that is going to be uncorks both hands in tight. Four punches landed, so he works his way in from the outside. And Stevenson on the defense does not affect that. On to segment six of the uh, third round. Shavers, a nice lead in this one thus far. Two stars inside for Stevenson, two stars inside for Shavers. They're going to exchange blows again. Shavers first. Uh, 23, that would have been a potential knockdown, but again, that not so tough trait has reduced Shaver's power to a six, so that is going to not come into play. 23 instead will be a wicked three punch combo, and Stevenson looking to get untracked here. Uh, halfway through the round, he misses. So, final minute of the third round, and this will be the first round that Shaver's has uh, come back and been decisive in his control, at least thus far. Stevenson could rally. They're going to exchange from the inside again. Shavers first. 0-8-19, possible cut, and eight from the inside. Uncorks both hands in tight. Four punches land. We'll come back for the cut. And going to be double potential cut, except uh, Teofilo misses. So Stevenson, four or less, and he is good. 40 seconds left in the round, and this has been all shavers. That right hand is definitely bothering Stevenson. Six is for both. It's going to be inside. Stevenson will be on the offensive. Oh, would have been a potential knockdown, but he is injured, and 91 is going to be a clinch anyway. So on to the final 20 seconds as Stevenson. Looking bewildered in there right now, and Shavers is going to take back momentum for the final segment of round three, and 93, that is going to be a clinch as well. So the round ends. A decisive round for Ernie Shavers as Stevenson does not land anything. Uh, 24 punches landed through the first two rounds, zero here, but 15 for Big Ernie. So that helps Shavers, that keeps his stamina at 36, heading into round number four. And that is going to knock Stevenson down to 42 heading into round four. So they're just about even there. 15-point uh, differential. Uh, this could be a 10-8 round. This is 10. Uh, Shavers is going to take the round on all three judges' card. Uh, if they roll 19 or 20, it will be 10-8. So 10-9, 10-9, and 10-9. So Ernie is pulled even in this fight after a big first round for Stevenson, the broken hand hampering him since then. Uh, round four is ready to get underway. And definite concern in the Cuban's corner. Outside two stars to inside two stars, and they are going to exchange blows. It will be from the inside since Shavers has that momentum. And Ernie would have been a potential knockdown, but he misses. Stevenson, 45, firing back. Rapid fire jabs connect. Only one of them is going to count due to the injury on to segment two, but Stevenson has a punch in at least this round. Outside, two stars to inside two stars. They're going to exchange this time from the outside, and Stevenson first as he has momentum. 0-6 lands heavy rights and lefts. Four punches landed, reduced to three due to the injury. And Ernie looking to fire back himself, and he uncorks both hands, gets in four of his own. So a nice exchange there between both fighters, and dead even right now, four punches apiece. Uh, one and a six, inside uh, one star, outside one star. And in that last segment, Ernie landed the most punches, so he has momentum, goes first, 77, and that's gonna be a miss. Teofilo, 87. Yep, 87, and that is going to be a clinch, so no action there as we head to segment four. 
Uh, five and a two, and two stars to one. Stevenson from the outside on the offense. 27, and he's watching all these potential knockdowns go for naught because his hand is broken. Uh, lands three punches, reduced to two. Ernie on the defense, a five, and Ernie's going to add that third one right back. So ends up being three punches landed for Stevenson due to Shaver's poor defense on that exchange. Six and a four, and Stevenson with control on the inside. Two stars to zero. Uh, 23, and a combo lands behind a jab. That's going to be reduced to two punches, and Ernie's defense, and again on the inside, he can block. Instead, he adds another one. So on to segment six of the fourth round. Uh, these guys are going back and forth. This round, all Stevenson. They're going to exchange again, this time from the outside, and again, Stevenson first. Uh, 47 from the outside, and that is going to be one punch getting through due to the injury. Shaver is looking to get off on his own, and 83, and not going to happen as he misses. Final minute of round number four, this round all Stevenson. They're just kind of exchanging rounds right now. Uh, inside, no stars to inside two, so Ernie snatches back momentum here. Stevenson will be on the defense, and 39 is going to be a potential cut. Uh, 39 is going to be two short hard punches land. And Stevenson, no defensive check. He'll go against his cut rating, which is a four now, and he is okay. So final 40 seconds of the fourth round. Uh, five and a six, outside two stars, outside one star. So Stevenson snatches momentum back. Shavers will be on the defense this time, and nine, that is four punches reduced to three due to the injury. And again, Shavers cannot block anything from the outside due to uh, Stevenson's trait, but he is going to add yet another. So final 20 seconds, and this has been a big round. Stevenson fighting through the pain of his broken right hand. Inside two stars to inside two stars. They're gonna to exchange to finish the round. Stevenson first. And 12 on the inside, lands heavy shots, four punches, landed, reduced to three. Ernie looking to get his own in. 33 on the inside, and a wicked three-punch combo. And that is the round, an exciting round there. 18 to nine in terms of punches landed. And Ernie, when he was getting a respite in terms of stamina, his stamina is reduced in half, down to 18 now, heading into the fifth round. And Stevenson's going to go down to 33. So a nine punch differential in that round. And it will go to uh, Stevenson on everything but a 20. So still, oh, Shavers, okay, someone is not watching the fight. So the second judge gave that round to Shavers, and that's going to make things interesting. The other two to Stevenson. As we get ready for round number five now. And again, if you're just joining us, Stevenson broke his hand in the first round. He cannot score any knockdowns the rest of the fight and also has one punch reduced every time he lands. Six and a three, two stars each from the inside. They are going to exchange blows. And uh, Ernie goes first, 50. He gets through with a couple and a potential cut. So Stevenson will go on his and then we will resolve the cut. And 30 from the inside, three punches land reduced to two, and cut check for Stevenson, and a 12, he is fine. Segment two of the fifth round. Six and a two, and two stars to one, both on the inside. Stevenson with control. And Big Ernie on the defense, and another two punches land, again being reduced due to that cut. And three, Ernie's having a tough time with his defense. He's going to add another punch to Stevenson there as we head to segment number three. So lots of blows getting through right now. Inside, uh, outside, I'm sorry, two stars for Stevenson, one for Shavers. And Stevenson will be on the offense, 69. He misses Shavers looking to counter four or less and does not. On to segment four. A five and a three, and this is going to be uh, inside, outside two stars to inside two stars. So they're going to exchange on the inside. Stevenson has momentum, so he goes first. 37, and kind of surprised Stevenson is fighting so much on the inside here. He lands one punch there. Again, two landed, but reduced to one. 
97, and that is a punch for Shaver. Is going to be a potential foul as well, however. Uh, 15 is over Shaver's foul rating of 5, so no foul as we head on to segment 5. 6 and a 2, and inside, Stevenson with control. Shavers only had one star there. 48 on the inside for Teofilo. He misses. Shavers looking to counter. A 6 does not. On to segment 6 of the 5th round. So things slowing up just a bit here. And Stevenson, two stars on the inside, has control. Shavers again will be on the defense. And 96, and that is going to be a potential foul. Now there, one punch, but again, his broken hand is going to make that zero. So six, I'm sorry, nine, uh, no foul for Stevenson. So we will head into the final minute of the round. And Shavers takes back control on the inside, two stars to one. And 87 is going to be a clinch, so 40 seconds left in the round. Double sixes, and Stevenson takes back control on the inside. He's fought a surprising large amount of this fight there. He lands heavy rights and lefts. Only three of them get through due to the injury, however. And Shavers, 11 does not affect those defensively. Final 20 seconds of the round, Shavers is fading rapidly. He's probably going to have one more round after this where he's going to be fresh. Outside two stars to no stars and Stevenson is going to control or finish the round in control. 79 going to be a miss. Shaver's looking to counter. Needs a four or less. Does not get it and that's the round. So definitely uh, both fighters falling off considerably in that round. Nine punches land to three. So that's going to put Shavers and Dorrance heading into round six at nine, and Stevenson's will be at 30. Uh, six punch differential. So scoring there, five to eight. One to 15 is going to go to Stevenson, 16 to 20 to Shavers. Let's see if the judges watch that round. Uh, second one again is giving it to Shavers. Oh, judges. I'm sorry, just the second one again. So that's the second time. Uh, he is given a round that was seemingly controlled by Stevenson to Ernie Shavers. So judges 1 and 3, 10, 9 Stevenson. Judge 2, 10, 9 Shavers. And we are getting ready for round number 6 here. And a lot of people didn't think this would last that long. And the reason it has probably a lot of that has to do with uh, Teopolo's broken right hand. Uh, outside, no stars for Stevenson. Inside, 2 for Shavers. Shavers will have control. And Stevenson will be on the defense. A 10 on the inside. Uncorks both hands in tight. Four punches land. Stevenson. And a 9 does not block any of those. On to segment number 2. So Shaver's off to a quick start in the 6th round. Two stars outside for Stevenson. Two inside for Shaver's. They're going to exchange on the inside since Shaver's has momentum. 25 and a wicked 3 punch combo gets through by Big Ernie. Stevenson. Fires back and misses, so on to segment three. And inside, two stars for Stevenson, two stars for Shavers also inside. Again, they're going to stay right in the pocket and exchange. 68, that's going to be a miss for Shavers. Stevenson looking to get through, and 0-2. Stevenson, blistering, two-handed assault, five punches land, again reduced to four. So we head to segment number four of the round. Stevenson with momentum has one star on the inside, as does Shavers. They're going to exchange from the inside again. So these two are staying in there. Uh, 95, and again, a potential foul. Uh, 13 is going to be above Stevenson's range. So there will be no foul there. And Ernie Shavers gets to throw his blows. And 83 is going to be a clinch. So no action regardless of what would have happened with Stevenson. Segment five of the round, and one and three, and Shavers takes back momentum, two stars to one from the inside. He's staying right on Stevenson's chest, and going to be a potential cut again as he uncorks a right hand in tight. Four more punches land. This round is definitely going to Ernie thus far. And again, four or less, 13, and again, Stevenson escapes with no facial damage as we head on to the sixth segment. Inside two stars to two inside for Shavers. So again, they're going to exchange punches toe to toe. Shavers first, 35, and wicked three punch combo. 
That gets Ernie up to 14 punches landed thus far in the round and 85. And that is going to be a clinch, so never mind those three punches landed. We head to the final minute of round number six. Shavers in command right now. Inside, two stars for Shavers. No stars on the outside for Stevenson. Stevenson will be on the defense. Shavers is giving uh, Teofilo quite the fight right now. 40 is going to be two punches landing. And defensive check for Stevenson, a five. And he's going to add one. So 40 seconds left in the round. This round has been all Ernie. There's been some interesting scoring by judge number two, also in favor of Ernie thus far. One star outside to two stars inside. So Shavers, again, will be on the offense. And he's throwing in a very good connect percentage right now in this fight. Another wicked three-punch combo. Teofilo's defensive check does not alter those as we head to the final 20 seconds of the round. A round that has decisively gone to Shavers. And Shavers will finish on offense. Stevenson on defense again. 33 and another potential cut. And a wicked three-punch combo. It's a huge round for Shavers. And Stevenson, is he going to get cut? No, he is not. So again, his cut rating of four. He does not cut easily. But that's the round. And this round, big time to Ernie Shavers. His best round of the fight by far. 20 punches to four, so Ernie's still going to have five stamina left as we head into the seventh round, and Stevenson down to four. More important, a 16-punch 16 uh, 16 differential, so a roll of 20 uh, gives this 10-8 uh, round to Shavers. 10-9, uh, 10-9, and 10-9. Well, Ernie is giving uh, the Cuban legend all he can handle. And again, you have to uh, think things would be somewhat different at this point if Stevenson had not broken his hand in the first round. It has hampered him throughout. So round number seven underway and stamina five for Shavers again, 10 for Stevenson, six and a four. And Stevenson's gonna have control on the inside to start the round. And 0-4, lands heavy rights and lefts, four punches reduced to three, again due to the injury, being redundant, but uh, one and a five, and inside one star to inside two star, Shaver snatches back momentum, and Shavers has been money uh, in the pocket thus far tonight, would have been a potential knockdown, instead it's going to be a miss, and Stevenson with a chance to counter five, he does, across, two punches reduced to one get through. And again, that reduction applies to all punches that land. Four and a two. So outside, no stars to inside one. Shavers on the offense and 38. This is going to be a potential knockdown. 38 will be a short, hard two punch combo. And chin check for Stevenson again. He'll only go down on two five. He doesn't go down, but he's hurt. Stevenson is hurt. Shavers has hurt him. And going into the fourth segment, he will have an unopposed action. It's going to come from the inside. And Stevenson looking to regather his senses. Shavers bores in. 59 misses would have been another potential knockdown. So he can't take uh, advantage of Stevenson's stunned state. And Teofilo will regain his senses for the next segment. Clears his head, two stars from the outside, two stars from the inside. They're going to exchange from the inside. Shavers goes first. And 81, another potential knockdown, but that's a miss. So Stevenson, 0-1, blistering two-handed assault. That's going to end up being four punches landing after the reduction. So Stevenson not only clears his head, but fires back decisively in that segment. Uh, two stars to one from the outside. Stevenson's now with momentum. 65, and that's going to be a miss. Would have been a potential cut. Shavers looking to counter. Does not. Into the final minute of the seventh round. And Shavers will definitely be out of endurance after this round. Deuce is wild, and two stars on the inside for Stevenson. He has control. Let's the hands go. 0-9, heavy lefts and rights land, and four punches reduced to three. Shavers. And again, can't block any from the outside due to Stevenson's trade. He does not add any. 40 seconds left in the round. Shavers needs to rally to get uh, Stevenson's stamina down as well. 
And he's going to have an opportunity as he takes back momentum. He'll be on offense from the inside. 47, and there's a two-punch salvo landing, and Stevenson doesn't block either of them. Final 20 seconds of the round, and Shaver still has only landed four blows in this round, however. Outside two stars to inside two stars, they're going to exchange, and since Shavers has momentum, it will come from the inside. Uh, 86, and that's going to be a clinch, would have been a potential knockdown, but Ernie wanted to hang on instead, and that is the round. So round seven in the books, 11 punches land to four Stevenson's favor. And that means heading into the eighth round, Stevenson will still have six stamina left, and Shavers will be gassed. So before, let's do the scoring and we'll uh, come back to the effects. Seven punch differential in that round. So one to 15 goes to Stevenson. Judge one gives it to him. Judge two has been kind of wonky in this one. Gives that to Stevenson finally as well. And 13, all three judges go Stevenson in that round. So round seven in the books. And Shavers now, his best chance was really to land that haymaker, and he's going to be greatly uh, hampered now in his ability to do that. So he's fatigued. His power goes down to a four normally, but it's a three uh, due to the fact that he has the not-so-tough trait. So power reduced to three. And his chin against a knockdown goes to six. Fortunately for him, Stevenson can't score a knockdown with that broken hand. Um... In addition to that, we will subtract one from every punch uh, that Ernie sure every series of punches that Ernie Shavers lands now as well. So both fighters uh, having one subtracted, and when Stevenson get tired, that will be two for him. So he's got to make some hay here and try to hang on. Round number eight, here we go. Uh, two to one, and it's going to be two stars each from the outside. Uh, they're going to exchange blows. And actually, I'm sorry, it's going to be from the inside. Ernie finished the last round with momentum, so Ernie goes first. Uh, 14 from the inside, uncorks both hands. That'll be three punches landed with a reduction. Stevenson fires back, misses, and on to segment two. So both fighters definitely are going to be uh, fatigued in the, uh, well, Shavers is, but uh, Stevenson will be fatigued in the ninth and tenth as well. And inside two stars, both fighters. Shavers is going to go first in the exchange, and 80 from the inside, he's going to miss. Stevenson looking to fire back, and Stevenson 0-9, lands heavy rights and lefts. Three punches landed due to the reduction for injury. So starting this round dead even, and 4-3. and three. Inside two stars for Shavers. Shavers will be on the offense, and Stevenson has never gone this long in his career, folks. 48, two punches land. For Shavers and Stevenson does not block them. So segment four of the eighth round. And three and a six inside two stars to one star outside. Stevenson takes back momentum and again needs a decisive round here. 74 not going to get it. Shavers looking to counter does not. On to segment five. This has turned into a surprisingly close fight and again due to that injury that has uh been the difference in this one. Stevenson still looks like it looks to have a slight lead, and he has the offensive control from the inside at this point in time. Double O's, blistering two-handed assault. That will be four punches getting through after the reduction. And Shavers does not add or reduce any there. Four and a six, and four from the outside, and one star, Shavers is going to take momentum. Stevenson had no stars there. So Shavers from the outside uncorks both hands in tight, going to end up being three punches landed. Stevenson's defensive check, and a two, he's going to block one of those. So final minute of round number eight. And again, looks like this fight may be going the distance, barring a miracle here, and it would have to come from Shavers. Uh, inside two stars each. So we will exchange from the inside and Big Ernie will go first. 81 from the inside, that's going to be a miss. Stevenson looking to get off on the inside. 36 and 36 is going to be rapid fire jabs connect. Two punches landed reduced to one. 40 seconds left in the eighth round. 
One in five, and Ernie Shavers takes control on the inside as he has been there most of the night, right on Stevenson's chest. A wicked three punch combo reduced to two. And Stevenson's defensive check does not block or affect any of those. 20 seconds left in the round. Here we go. Inside two stars to inside two stars. They're going to finish the round with an exchange, and Big Ernie's going to go first. 53 on the inside. He misses Stevenson. Going to punctuate the round with a nice flurry, and if only his hand wasn't broke. Would have been a potential knockdown. A blistering two-handed assault. Going to be reduced to four punches land to finish the round. And bell rings. And Stevenson pulls in front there. 12 punches to nine. Um, in terms of stamina, Stevenson now is also reduced to zero. So both fighters fatigue. Uh, how that affects Stevenson, his power drops. Doesn't matter with his power since he can't get a knockdown. Uh, his chin goes up to a four for a knockdown, three for a knockout. So that could still, that could still come into play. Uh, Shavers needs a three or less to have a potential knockdown, but it is still an opportunity. So three punch differential. And this will be 1 to 11 Stevenson, 12 to 17. Uh, so that's going to be Shavers, Shavers, and Stevenson. So Stevenson really needed that round. Instead, judges 1 and 2 give it to Ernie Shavers. And this fight is still up in the air going into the final uh, two stanzas here. Both fighters fatigue now, so Stevenson, because of fatigue and the injury, will have any punch uh, landed result reduced by two for the final two rounds. So that could play into a very big upset here, and Shavers is going to start round nine with control from the inside. Uh, 41 from the inside, and that's going to be uh, two short hard punches land. Stevenson's defense does not block any of those, uh, again reduced to one due to fatigue. So I um, don't expect a lot of uh, scintillating exchanges here in these final two rounds due to reductions on both fighters. Uh, outside two stars to inside two stars are going to exchange on the inside. Shavers first. Shavers has been a demon on the inside. 44, it's going to be one more punch landing. And Stevenson, 81, and that's going to be a miss. So segment three. And inside one star to outside no star. Stevenson on the offense from the inside, 74, and that's going to be a miss as well. So Shaver's looking to counter, 14, doesn't. On to segment four. One's for both, and Shaver's going to get the offensive roll from the inside. Uh, 41, and that's going to be another single punch landed. Stevenson's defense lets it through, six. Segment number five, so one punch at a time we go. Outside two stars to inside two stars with momentum shavers. So they're going to exchange from the inside toe-to-toe. -to -toe. 57, going to be a miss for shavers. That would have been that potential knockdown he was looking for. Stevenson, again, another potential knockdown wasted. Lands heavy rights and lefts. Four punches landed. That's going to be reduced to two due to fatigue and injury as we head to segment number six. Six and a five, and it's going to be an exchange from the inside. This time Stevenson goes first with momentum. Zero nine, and again, landing heavy rights and lefts, reduced down to two punches landed. Shavers looking to fire back, and ten. And uncorks both hands in tight. He's going to get three punches in there. So final minute of the ninth round, and this round is close. Five and a six, outside two stars to one star. Stevenson will be on the offense. And 61, that's going to be a miss. Shavers can counter him. Doesn't. 40 seconds left in the round. Uh, two and a three, and going to be outside exchange, toe to toe. Stevenson first. 64, that's going to be a miss. And 91 from the outside, that's going to be a clinch, so it wouldn't have mattered if Stevenson had landed. Both fighters exhausted now. Outside two stars to inside two stars. Again, they're going to exchange from the outside, and again, Stevenson goes first. 99, we're going back to the event chart, folks. And again, as a reminder, we have had an asterisk or rare event already, so we cannot have a second one. 
14, and that's the exact same thing, a broken right hand. So we're just going to ignore that, and round is over. So six to four for Shavers in the ninth round, and we are heading, it looks like, for a decision right now. A two-punch differential, and again there, two-punch, one to 11 will go to Shavers, 12 to 17, Stevenson, 20 is even. So that's even. Shavers and Shavers. Judge 2 has been giving everything to Shavers that's been close thus far. So we might have an upset brewing here, folks. It is very close just looking at the scorecards, a potential draw even. So let's see how it shakes out. Uh, Stevenson, both fighters need this round. Four is to start it, and it's going to be an exchange from the outside. Uh, Stevenson will go first, and 0-9, a potential cut, and again, heavy rights and lefts landed reduced to two. We'll come back to check the cut after uh, Shavers goes. Um, 50, and 50 from the outside, that's going to be a dead miss, so checking for the cut, and Shavers, seven or less, and no injury to him. So two and a five, outside two stars to inside two stars. They're going to exchange again from the outside. Again, Stevenson goes first. He's getting good numbers. Another two punches get through after reductions. And Ernie from the outside is not good. He needs 38 or less to land. He gets, uh-oh, potential knockdown. And two punches are going to get through with the fatigue reduction. And this could get exciting. We have not had either. Stevenson has been hurt. Neither fighter down thus far. So two, potential knockdown, and Stevenson's chin right now is a four on the knockdown, and he takes it. No problemo. So a little bit of tension there late in this one. Uh, outside, no stars for Stevenson. Shavers now in bold. He has the offensive control from the inside. 55 going to be a miss. Shavers, or I'm sorry, Stevenson looking to counter does not. On to segment four. And uh, inside again, Shaver's on con with the offensive control. And again, he misses. So Stevenson looking to counter three. He counters, but he has a two-punch reduction due to fatigue and injury, so he can't land anything. Six and a four, inside two stars to outside no stars. Stevenson with the offensive control. Uh, 54 from the inside, and rapid fire, oops, nope, that's going to be a miss, never mind, and looking to counter Shavers, he does it, both fighters are exhausted, Stevenson has never gone this far in his life, inside one star, to inside two, so Shavers, with offensive control, 54 from the inside, he misses, Stevenson looking to counter, doesn't matter, even if he does land, they'll be both reduced, so this fight is finishing slow and outside two stars to nil. Stevenson again with offensive control. 35 and Stevenson from the outside. Three punches land, reduced down to one. And on the inside, Shavers can block that. Seven, he does not. 40 seconds to go in this fight. A slight edge in this round to Stevenson. Two stars on the inside, two stars on the inside for Shavers as well. They're going to exchange. Toe to toe they go, Stevenson first, 13. And heavy rights and lefts, that's gonna be reduced to two punches landed, Shavers. Needs a miracle again, neither fighter has been down. Stevenson was hurt earlier in the fight as Shavers misses, final 20 seconds. Has Stevenson done enough to pull it out in this round? Six to one, and they're gonna exchange on the inside to end the fight. Again, Stevenson goes first. 91 and kind of anticlimactic. It's going to end in a clinch, and that is the final bell. So, in the last round, Stevenson, seven punches to two, a five punch differential, and this round could very well decide the fight. Let's see how the judges score it. And again, five to eight, one to 15 goes to Stevenson. Oh my god, Shavers, Stevenson. And Stevenson. So it gets interesting. All right, this fight, and again, most people did not think this would go the distance, but it has. Stevenson and Shavers goes all 10 rounds. This fight had it all. Stevenson was hurt, broke his hand in the first round. It was definitely a factor in the fight as we add up the scores.
And again, Judge 2 had some very uh, questionable scoring in there. It's going to be close, folks. Wow, it's super close. And I didn't, I used generic judges in this one, but you would think Adelaide Bird was judge number two. Holy cow. All right, here's your scoring. Judge number one, after hard 10 fought rounds, sees it 96 Stevenson, 95 Shavers. Judge number two, Scores it 98 Shavers, 94 Stevenson. Crowd boos. And judge number three scores it 96 to 95. Your winner by split decision from Cuba, Teofilo Stevenson. So the debut of Teofilo Stevenson was definitely uh, one for the ages, and he. Uh, he had definitely all he could handle in the form of one Ernie Shavers, an exciting fight. And again, the big, uh, the big storyline in this one was Stevenson breaking his hand in the first round. And the effect of that injury made it so Stevenson could not score any knockdowns. And he had several opportunities that he did not get to uh, even follow up on because of that. Shavers did have uh, Stevenson hurt and had him hurt in round number six, but Stevenson was able to uh, weather the storm there, neither fighter again on the deck, and some questionable scoring from judge number two in this one, but it was definitely a close fight, very competitive fight, and you have to think it would have been much different had Stevenson not broken his hand. He possibly could have scored a knockout, especially later as Shavers uh, tired, but Still a very fun and exciting fight, and the uh, debut on the channel of Teofilo Stevenson is a fun one. So that is that, and this fight is in the book. Stevenson was looking to get past Shavers to set up that dream match with Muhammad Ali, which uh, will be upcoming. And people now might not think he deserves it, but he's going to get it anyway because the ultimate bottom line is he got the W. So, uh, final punch stats in this one. Let's add these up real quick. So, Shavers landed 88 uh, significant punches. Wow, it was that close, folks. Uh, Stevenson landed 89. So there you have it. Um, judges 1 and 3 definitely seem to be right on top of things. Judges, Judge 2 scoring still kind of a couple of head-scratching rounds in there, but it was a very close competitive fight. 89 punches to 88 landed in Stevenson's favor. And again, uh, you have to remember every time he did land punches, it was reduced by one uh, up until the point he got fatigued because of that injury. So um, you could add probably another 12 to 15 punches onto that. So that would have made a difference. But that will do it here. And again, just a week away from release. It releases May 13th, which is one week from tomorrow. And I showed you to start the video our little shipping area here our game which is what our game room has become so excited to get this out and very excited and appreciative of all the support uh, big shout out to everyone who's commented on the game and, and expressed their intent to buy it uh, very grateful to you and i'm glad that uh, uh glad that um the game is appealing and again uh creating this game started out just as creating a game that i wanted to play and and just very excited and also humbling that uh, other people have interest in it as well. So until next time, uh, keep swinging for that knockout and have a great night, everyone, and have a good upcoming week. We'll see you later.